2K Sports welcomes you to the following presentation of the NBA. And preparing for battle, each guy with his own approach to getting ready for what should be an excellent matchup. Hello out there, and get ready for some NBA basketball on 2K Sports. Brian Anderson here. With me tonight are analysts Richard Jefferson and Grant Hill, and our reporter, Allie LaForce. Now the starting group for the visitors. One thing each of these teams can do is pass the rock, Grant. We should see a lot of ball movement tonight. Hey, sharing is caring. And of course, there's great chemistry on both teams. There's such a flow to this game when they get together. And we're going to see some terrific team basketball tonight. I can't wait. Here's Perez. There's the triple. That shot off. He didn't make them pay for that weak defense, but they just can't rely on him to miss those kind of shots. And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. Grant, usually the Suns rack up lots of assists. They're a team that values ball movement. Oh, B.A., that's how you create quality looks. By snapping the ball around, it also tells you something about how selfless these guys are. Here's Perez. It's hauled in by Black. And the defense was all over him once he got in close. Didn't want him to get too comfortable. Out to the right wing. Five to shoot. Shot from 16. And that one off the back of the rim and in. And hitting from the mid-range here and early. I mean, really gives the defense just another thing to worry about. And you don't see many teams take these shots as often anymore. It's nice to see them take advantage in this area. The offensive rebound and he was fouled while in the act of shooting so he'll take two free throws <laughs> no debate there he got him at the line for the away team number 15 down the first one. It's both from the stripe. It's always nice to see a big fella be able to knock down some free throws and make teams pay from the line. First minute and a half of basketball played here in this one. And he lobs it up. Got a piece of it. And that goes out of bounds. And they retain possession. Just five on the clock. Here's Perez. Knocks it loose. And they're on the break. Hodge. And he lays it in on the break. Well, when you're careless with the ball, that's what happens. 
it ends up going the other direction. And there's no defense for that. Live ball turnovers, they are the worst. Here's Perez to the middle. Pass to Black. First quarter of ball, almost two and a half minutes in. Tipped, and they're able to recover. Goes back up. Can't get it to go. Missed his first one. He did everything in his power to make that a hard shot. Excellent D, avoided fouling, and got in perfect position to alter that shot. Making a statement here early, going right to the rack. Oh, I love it. Yeah, it's nice to see him be assertive instead of settling for a jump shot, especially in the first quarter. Yeah, coach no doubt wants to use this timeout to review the matchups and maybe make some adjustments as well. I'm sure all of the above is in order, and you can never be too content. And in the first quarter, about three minutes played. Gets it to drop. Now two of four. Got it in close, and unless it's an open three, that's the key to efficient offense. Great teamwork and great time. Oh, spectacular play. Gone just three for seven here at the start. Can't get it to fall. 0 for 2 now. Probably should have scored there. He usually does. Ooh, the lead pass was in the perfect spot to set up the layup. Starting to find his rhythm. He's cooking, and he knows it. Yeah, when he gets engaged this early in the game, it's bad news for the defense. He can roll this start throughout the rest of the game. And he lobs it up to the rim. And an emphatic jam on the lob. Nice feed inside. Saw the play develop and hit him right when he needed to. Yes, it's good. He's got six. And that's how you lead a team. Literally. Gone four of nine in this one so far. And play stops. A whistle there on what looks like an illegal screen. The screener was leaning a bit right there. His feet may not have been planted. Pretty obvious call by the officials. Well, guys get away with this all the time, but on this occasion, he got caught. Shooting right around 57%. Very efficient so far in the first. Get through, get through, get through. To the inside. Shot is up. Can't hit the turnaround jumper. Shooting 44% to start this ballgame. Shot clock at six. Sinks it. What range from downtown. Don't want to let him get into a rhythm from out there. Shoots from 12. The shot misses. Well, some cribs you get the shot you want, it just doesn't fall. I'd go back to him in that area on the floor. I don't mind that. I mean, they met him at the rim and temporarily defended the points. At the line for your home team. Hodge. Two shots. And he drops the first. And he makes both free throws. For a star like him, you get lots of opportunities at the line, and he's great at cashing them in. Pass to 
Perez. And he lays it up and in. Good execution. They're getting some short-range looks here. Gotten 50% of their shots to fall so far. They're 5 of 10. And the shot's good. Number 20. Five points in the game. And they may have talked about shot selection coming into this. Inside. And he makes no mistake. Slam dunk. He almost brought the basket down on top of himself. Oh, there's hang time, and then there's a time to hang. Over to the wing. Launches it. Two minutes remaining in the first. Two minutes. Out left to the wing. And Three. there's that a three-second three violation. The ball goes to the away team. Gone. Six of 11 so far. We've got a minute 48 left to play in the first quarter. Deflected! To the left wing. The shot. And he can't get that one. Shooting a solid 50% in the opening quarter. Ross can't get it to go. Yeah, we're not used to seeing him get bottled up like that. Wow. Three left in the first quarter. Here's Perez. With some arc. Oh, it misses. Had a chance to tie it. Gone one or two from three-point land so far. Down low. Soft touch off the glass. Looked like he was playing against his little brother out there. The way he just went right over him with his height. Pass to Ross. 26 seconds left in the first quarter. To the paint. And it falls for him. He's now four of seven from the field. Credit their discipline. They've been working for high percentage shots. Takes it inside. Banked it in off the glass. Assisted by Chris. Number There's eleven. six seconds left to play in the first. Here's Perez. Knocks down Perez. the step back J. Perez has got his second basket of the game. And still a close That's game the as the first quarter score. comes to a close. Your home team. Up two. And the second quarter Assisted about to get started. 18. We'll be back in a moment. one quarter of play and from what we've seen here from the home team what's your take so far well what i love is the tremendous belief in their bench they were looking for points and the reserves delivered sometimes you just need a change of pace the bench delivered that and with load management some say it's the team's job at times to protect players from themselves how different is that from when you play grant you know ba it's very different i think teams now are much smarter assessing load and risk and looking more at the long-term big picture of their players and usually that's a bucket for him but look nobody's perfect in the mid-range two points goes to that one goes number 91 Shooting 47% on this one. Looking efficient. Played it in with a nice touch off the window. Nah, it's just ridiculous. He's just an absolute surgeon when he has the ball. This man is surgical. There is no way to slow him down when he wants to score. Now here's Ross. 
No points so far. Step back and fire. That one off the back iron and out. He was so well positioned to interfere with the shot. Textbook defense take a good angle to the shooter and bother the release. And that one drops for him. In the NBA, you just can't let guys get to the rim. Right now, a close game for Phoenix. And let's swing it over to the sideline and hear from Allie. The Miami Heat are a team of underdogs and overachievers. Their all-star big man, Bam Adebayo, said, quote, we like guys like that with those stories of I got cut, this and that in the third. You know, blue-collar people that had to work for what they got. And Brian, when you play for the Heat, hard work is what keeps you on the court. That is the truth. Thanks, Allie. Good stuff. And that one, good. Gone just one of three to begin the second quarter. First bucket of the game. Number 15. Quarter two in about two minutes in. <laughs> Misses from short range. Gone two of four here in the second quarter. Inside. It's tipped. Here's Perez. Misses in close. Showing great intensity around the rim is part of why he's a respected defender. Yeah, you can see why he's established that reputation. Strong understanding of how to defend at the rim. And he drives in. Black, no good. Shooting about 48% from the floor. Pretty good. Here's Ross. Got a hand on it. I love great defense. Just quick to establish his feet, and he takes the hit. Both teams deciding to change it up. Substitution on the court. Gets the 14-footer to fall. He's got 12. Just not quite tight enough on him to impact his shot. He got a good look off. Down low. And that's good. His first bucket of the game. And finding his teammate in stride, he led his guy perfectly. To the middle. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. Personal foul, first team foul. Shooting for the away team. Number 15 at the line for two. First one falls. And that one goes in. Two from the line that time. Gone four for seven in the second quarter. And just over three and a half minutes played here in the second quarter. Count that bucket. Hey, that right there was a lot of confidence given the size of the disadvantage there. And I like his belief in his game. Go at the taller defender, make him react to you. from outside and the defense got away with one there I mean that's the shot he typically makes here's black paddles through traffic and lays it in 
Clock's got eight. A nifty play off the dribble. Creates barely enough space to get off the shot. It counts, and he is on his way to the line to try to make it a three-point play. At the line for the away team, number 33, one shot. gotten six of nine attempts to go in the second. Looking good. Missed it. Four for eight in the contest. Shooting at 44% in the second. A decent rate. Over to the left wing. Ooh, he's looking comfortable now. Three for three. Used the pick to perfection and got all the way to the rim. Fires the three. Nice start for him. Sinking his first shot. Defensively, got to close out a little faster. That's a look he'll make with regularity. He's got Number it. 14. Four for four now. He's automatic. No settling for an outside shot there. They went right to the hoop. Ooh, and he took a hard foul on the shot. Number so he'll head to the line to shoot a pair. Personal foul. First team foul. At the line for your home team. Number 19! Palmelang, Palmelang. Belong Tira. First free throw is good. And he can't hit the second. Shooting 52% from the floor so far. And the foul is called. He missed it, so he's got a couple of free throws coming his way. Josh Richardson is a guy who helps you in a number of ways, RJ. Yeah, he can defend, pass, and shoot. Gives you veteran leadership. Valuable part of the rotation. And the first one at the line is good. So he's able to get one of two. Gone seven for 11 in the second quarter. Into the lane. Controls the rebound and the putback. He'll be around the rim. Defense has always got to know his whereabouts. One forty-six left to play in the second quarter. Shoots a fadeaway. That one doesn't go. He's now five for nine in this one. He's gotten eight of 13 shots to fall in the second quarter. And he 
And he banks in the layup. Number 20. He has seven. Woo. Just selling the defense on the pump fake. Gotten six of their 12 attempts to go since the end of the first. Three left in the first half. There's one for the low light. Oh, I'm not sure who messed up the pass, but somebody did. So both teams changing it up here. And 101 left in the second period. The fadeaway. It doesn't go for him. Great contest by the defense, and he's unable to hit that tough fadeaway. That won't go. Five for ten from the floor. Shooting is around 55% so far. Oh, they get a hand on it. Shot clock and game clock separated by less than six seconds. Number 15. And that one's good. Assisted. Good passing to Zero. set that up. Teamwork on display. Sixteen seconds left in the half. Six on the shot clock. From the high post. And the shot Number goes. 22. Okay, let's throw out the analytics for a moment. When he's taking the mid-range, it's a winning shot. Oh, and he hits it! That's the buzzer! Monster buzzer beater helps carve into that deficit. It's anyone's game now. And so a close game as we wrap up the first half of play. Up by three. Well, now a minute to check in with Allie LaForce. She's courtside. Hey, Allie. Thanks. I'm here with Frank Vogel and coach. The offense seemed to get on track in the second quarter. What changed for you? We just settled down offensively. You know, it seemed like we had some nerves early on in the game. We were attacking a paint, trying to play extra pass basketball, but we were a little hesitant. I thought we just settled down in this quarter. Hopefully more aggressive in the second half. Thanks. All right, Allie, thanks for that. We will see everyone right back after this break. Ready for the second half. The 2K Sports Halftime Show. Welcome back, everyone, to the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Some big-time action already in this one. I'm Ernie Johnson, along with Kenny the Jet Smith and Shaquille O'Neal. Taking a look at this home squad, Kenny, what was your impression? The bench unit was an essential part of the puzzle in the first half. They really stepped it up in a big way, and that helped out. And now the starters can appreciate not having to carry the load on their own. Shaq, let's get your insight on the visiting team. They were strong in transition. Seemed like the guys fed off the higher. And that'll do it. And we're halfway through this one. Plenty of basketball left in a game that's been a fairly even one. A step back shot. No luck on that one. Shooting 52% from the floor so far. Pass to Perez. Good Number job 15. in the low post. He's got 18. Clock at six. The savvy little up fake there, fooling the D. Oh, what a crafty move, causing the defender to pause right there. Perfectly for the layup. Great teamwork on that drive. Punctuated by a strong finish. Yeah, that's nice execution. Running with purpose and creating an easy scoring opportunity off the break. Comes up empty down low. Got two of three from the floor in this third quarter. 
third quarter of play with just over one and a half minutes gone by. Here's Black. Give him eight points now. Launches it from deep. That one no good. Gone just one of three in the second half. Here's Perez. And he lost it up top. Throw it down yes, on the lob. Perez. The great read between those two guys. The defense didn't stand a chance, B.A. These two teammates right here, Grant, they are connected. Just under two and a half minutes into this third quarter now. It's two on one. Up ahead. Oh, get that out of here. They retain possession. Can't hit from in close. Shooting has been excellent so far. Around 56%. Drains it. His six making nine tries so far. Keeping pace here. That's an excellent move inside. That one falls. Perez has got eight. Gone three of five from the field in this third quarter. on the clock ah nice fake there to create the shot but it's no good second half here and we're just over three and a half minutes into it count it number 14 he's got 10 Assisted he by saw a path to the rim and he took it the defense just couldn't stop him it in from the elbow they get it back now that takes serious effort and a light touch no need to overdo it just lightly tip it in to the wing right side Missed it. Five for seven from the field. Gone four of eight in the third. Right wing. Shoots off the step back. Can't hit that one. Shooting a nice 50% for the game. To the inside. Misses the layup. Shooting at a 44% clip in the third. He takes it in. Here's Black. That one a little long. Black's gone 40% from the floor in 10 attempts. Out to the wing. Hits the Number jump hook. 15. 22 points for him. Just what they wanted from that possession. A quality look in tight. The three is up. No good gone 5 of 11 in this third quarter for the lead and he lays it up and in we've seen five lead changes so far neither team able to pull away yeah this game just feels like it's going to come down to the wire Ooh, plenty of contact on that shot the officials call the foul and he'll take two free throws now foul first team foul at the line for two, number 22. First free throw is good.
Both good from the line that time. Gotten six of their first 12 shots to drop in this third. And a foul called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. Personal foul, first team foul. Shooting for the away team. Zero. Taking two shots. Shooting two. First one falls for him. So he makes both from the line. Going 0 for 2 from outside here Two in the third. In the third. Two minutes. 156 left in the third quarter here. Torres. Fade away. That shot is off. Shooting at about 51% for the game so far in this one. To the wing on the left. Six to shoot. No good there. Off the double clutch. Shooting efficiently. 50% so far. Poke loose. The officials whistle a foul on the shot. Number the bucket 32. is good, and he'll go to the line. Defensive foul. And you have to love the focus. He gets hit, but converts First it anyway. Foul. Second team foul. At the line for your home team, number 32. Free throw, no good. Gone 6 of 13 to open up this second half. Fifty-four seconds left in the third. Tipped. Offline from the high post. Well, the defense didn't have any impact on that shot, but somehow he still misses it. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. Personal foul, third team foul. At the line for your home team, number 23. Two shots. Makes a first. And that's good as he hits both shots. Shooting the rock around 43% since the third quarter began. And we've got 28 seconds left in the third. Just 
Just five to shoot. Pass to Ross. Puts up a three. And the three-pointer goes. Ross has gotten himself going with a triple. His first basket of the game. It's tipped. To the paint. Oh, a great one-two punch. A beautiful pass and a nasty jam. And it's amazing. Neither team has been able to hold the lead for any length of time. Yeah, these guys are leaving it all on the floor tonight. Three quarters of play and a close one here. Leading by just two. And when we return, we'll get the fourth quarter rolling here on 2K Sports. And now we have a moment to reveal our State Farm assist of the game. You talk about painting a magnificent picture with that, Don. Just a great decision and a perfect delivery. A lot of times a spectacular pass is more impressive than a spectacular shot. This is one of those times. And it's been a very competitive game so far as we get rolling here in quarter number four. Perez. Missed inside. Shooting at 49% so far in the game. It's down. His seventh make in 13 attempts today. And this is just oh. typical of him always making an impact at crucial moments in the game. And his team needs every bit of his production if they want to pull this one out. It is neck and neck here in the final period. Beautiful setup on the alley-oop. Great catch, great flush. And we played through about a minute here in the fourth. Out to the right wing. 13 feet out. Rebounded by Perez. That was a good call. The defense wasn't established. First team foul. Substitution on the court. Shooting 51%. Good clip from the field. From outside the arc. That one's off. He's four for nine. Started by Ross. Fourth quarter now. We're about a minute and a half in. It's deflected. That is now his seventh field goal in ten attempts. Impressive. Gotten just one shot to fall out of three attempts in the fourth. Guarded by Ross. He gets it in there. And you want him taking good shots at this point in the game. And that one was easy. Yeah, it's clear why they go to him in these moments. They know he's going to deliver for it. Fourteen feet away. No good on the shot. That is not a bad decision to pull it from there. It was just a little bit off with the execution. And he drops in the layup off the glass. And this game is tied up now. It's winning time, and that's a winning play. Just over two and a half minutes played now. Final quarter of regulation. Perez with the bucket. That's exactly the kind of shooting you need down the stretch to win games. Gone three of five since this fourth quarter started. And rejected. Inside. Oh, and there's a one-hand jam. 
Nice one-handed jam. Simple and effective, B.A. Hey, with the lead, I'm surprised you didn't come up with something a little more creative. From 18 feet away, the shot comes out. I think he's gone completely dry. Nothing is hitting. Yeah, and the risk now Number is 15. that he gets inside his yes, own head. Time Ross. to take deep breaths in through the nose, out through the mouth, and let the game come to you. Shot clock at six. To halt the run. Doesn't go for him. Gone five of eight from the field so far in the fourth. Pass to Perez. Finished off the break. Looks like they're gaining some confidence here in crunch time. Building out this lead brick by brick. They have taken a very methodical approach. The three sinks it from distance. 21 points in the game. When he decides he wants to take it to the bucket, it's really hard for anyone to slow him down to the middle. He shoots it. And he gets Number a friendly 15. roll as that one goes. Pick works well there, but the defense left a lot to be desired. Yeah, that just comes down to a lack of effort. The defender has to do a better job fighting through the screen. Fans, you're you this one! And now a moment to present the New Balance player of the game. He has truly put on a show out there tonight, tearing it up on both ends of the floor. So impressive. And the other squad has looked helpless to stop him. Man, if only he could play this well every night. This hometown crowd was not prepared for him to just go off like he did in this one. All right, let's check in with Allie LaForce. I was able to listen in on what Frank Vogel told the team earlier. They were encouraging their team to run, look for breaks. Coach wants to see them getting into transition more. Back to you, Brian. Okay, thanks, Allie. Gets to the rim for two with the D all over him. Taking people to school with moves like that. Bucket. He's now 9 for 11 after that one. And man, is he in a zone right now. Seems like he can't miss. It's tipped. Tipped away. In transition, here they come. Hodge. And it's blocked. And the ball ends up out of bounds. And they'll keep possession. And his struggles continue offensively. A perfect example of how to protect the rim. This is why he's out there in situations like this. He stands tall to prevent points. Down low. That's Tim. To the left side wing. Just four to shoot. The putback. Boy, he hangs in there and cashes in on the second chance points. And those second chance buckets are major bonus points if you can get them. Step back shot, and the shot goes in. Nice move to set up the jumper. <laughs> that was pretty. Gotten three of their seven threes to find the net in this matchup. And there's 138 left to play in the fourth quarter of this one. Oh, that was pure. He's got another one. Now 10 for 12. Taking it right at the rack. I mean, that defense is looking real frustrated. That's the kind of aggression you want to see when you've got a team on the ropes. The three is up. Rebounded by Perez. Shocking that he just bricked that one. The defense got real lucky there. Right side. 
Down to five on the shot clock. Got a piece of it. Shots good by Black. Transition basketball. The most reliable way to generate easy looks. Yeah, when you hustle on the break like he does, good things tend to happen. And he Number takes 15. it in for the layup off a, a very ball. nice feed. Number 14. Yeah, they blocked out the noise, blocked out the distractions, kept on grinding, and this is their reward. All oh, road wins. They're just so sweet. They're just so sweet. Do you know why? Because they are so hard to come by. To the wing on the left. This one for three. Got a hand on it. Here's Perez. The visiting club takes the win on the road. The they the have to feel good about this performance. It's one they can be proud of. Very true. I mean, routine. when you're out on the road, the wins can feel a little sweeter. This one has to feel extra special. And now let's check in with Allie LaForce with the player of the game. Allie. Fam, of all the aspects that went into this win, which do you think was most important? I do think, man. You know, when it got down to crunch time, we really locked in, and we pride ourselves on that, like I always say. And, you know, we take those matchups, those one-on-one -on -one matchups personal. And we got the stops, and we got a W. We got to tough this one out. It's always better when you can make it personal. Thanks so much, fam. All right, Allie, thank you. Thank you for joining us. That'll do it for now. For our terrific 2K Sports crew, this is Brian Anderson saying thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.